guys welcome back to my channel it's your girl tupo if you're new here welcome 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 please subscribe like comment give me a thumbs up guys today i'm going to be showing you the easiest way you can achieve box braids so if you guys want to see how i achieve this look please continue watching Alright guys, my hair is already washed and moisturized. I'm going to be using my rat tail comb, my rubber bands, and my scrunchies to achieve this look. So what you're going to do is you're going to start by sectioning your hair from ear to ear, just a straight line exactly the way I'm doing. You're going to part your hair again in the middle, just a straight line. Try to make it as straight as possible because if you like to wear your hair in the middle, this is exactly where you're going to be parting it, okay? So you're going to take your scrunchie and then you're going to be holding the top part. You're going to hold the right part and then you're also going to hold the left side. I'm going to be using my shine and jump. What I do is I start going um, straight line ear to ear as well. I'm gonna use my fingers as my guide, you know, just to make sure it's really nice and straight or whatever. And then I'm going to take my shine and jam, making sure it's nice and crisp. And then I'll go over it again, you know, just to make sure it looks really nice and clean. And then in the back, I'm going to do about four sections. So what I do is I try to fill it, you know, just to make sure I'm getting really nice equal parts. And then I use my front mirror and my back mirror just to make sure everything looks really nice and clean. Yeah, 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 yeah. I use my rubber bands to secure my hair once I'm sectioning because I want to make sure these lines are really nice and crisp when I'm done sectioning and when I start braiding, the lines are still there. Because you know I have 4C hair, so if I try to section my hair and not use rubber bands, the lines are just going to disappear. So I'm not trying to work twice. So that's exactly what I do, guys. Very, very easy to section. <laughs> show you guys like you know what you can actually section your hair by yourself you know using two mirrors so that's exactly what i do i actually go with my fingers just to guide me guys in the back especially in the back hey, 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 hey. once you get a grip on this sectioning guys it is over like listen the streets are gonna be like who's been doing your hair hey, 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 hey. happy new year each and every one of you guys Happy New Year, sisters. 2022, we are here. I hope you guys are having a blessed day as we are talking right now, okay? I'm wishing you guys nothing but the best in 2022. We are actually going to reach our goals in 2022. Once I'm done, you know, sectioning in the back, I'm just gonna do the same type of thing, you know, boxes, and then using my rubber bands to secure the boxes, guys. So once I section each box, I take my shine and jam, make sure it's really nice and crisp. Very, very easy, especially the front is easy to section, guys. So I'm going to do the exact same way on the other side as well. So just sectioning, using my shine and jam, and then sectioning the boxes using my rubber bands to secure it. The same rubber bands that I'm using, guys, I'm going to be using these rubber bands to actually braid as well so make sure you know um you don't just toss them out once you're done you know or whatever you gotta keep them and you know use them once you start braiding I have about 75 sections right here. It took me about 45 minutes to section because these sections are really tiny. So I just wanted to show you guys like you can actually do this by yourself. I'm going to be using this 3X pre-stretched hair. This is color SM1B27. Comes three in a pack and I'm using three and a half packs, guys, okay? So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take it out of the pack exactly the way I'm doing. This is 58 inches and it is already pre-stretched. So I love that. I'm going to section a little piece off and then I'm going to section that little piece into two pieces So I'm gonna have a smaller piece and a bigger piece exactly the way I'm doing just like you're trying to do like a traditional braid or whatever And then uh, I'm going to be using my crochet needle guys Taking my hair clip just to hold the other hair out of the way and then I'm going to be taking the rubber band out I'm going to take my shine and jam. Once I'm done slicking down using my shine and jam, I'm just gonna take my rubber band and secure my natural hair. Exactly the way I'm doing, so you don't have to secure it too tight because you wanna be able to pass in your crochet needle as well as the braiding hair assist, okay? Once I'm done, 
I'm just gonna take my crochet needle, open it, and then place it in exactly the way I'm doing. And then I'm going to take this smaller piece of the braiding here, guys, place it on the hook, and then close the hook and pull it out. So once I pull it, I'm going to pull one of the strands out. So I'm going to make sure it's going to be equal both sides, guys. Separate my natural hair into two and then give it a little tug. That way it is tight, but not way too tight that it's gonna give you a headache or it's going to break your natural hair. Take a little bit more of the shine and jam and then apply it to the natural hair. Anyway, so I'm going to make sure I flip the hair back. So I'm gonna take the bigger piece of the braiding hair and then place it on the top exactly the way I'm doing. And then I'm just gonna go around like I'm trying to tie a knot, you know, going into a circular motion or whatever. Exactly the way I'm doing, just do it once and then start braiding down. And that is all you are going to do, sis. Very, very easy, very beginner friendly. Anybody can actually do this. Why was do talking, sis? Have you subscribed to my channel? Don't forget to turn on your notification button so you do not miss out on any uploads because this channel is getting what? Juicy! Yes! I wanted to do this style um, because a lot of people were telling me that the previous style that I did, they were not able to grip the hair. Once they placed the hair on the top, they were not able to do it. So if you haven't watched that video, you better go watch that one as well. So you're just gonna take a little piece at the end and tie a little knot. That way your hair does not unravel. You don't have to work twice or whatever. This technique right here, sis, if you have never been able to braid anybody's hair, your daughter's hair, your sister's hair, your mama's hair, your cousin's hair, anybody, you can actually do this technique right here. And when I tell you, it is going to work, trust me, okay? You're just gonna take your crochet needle, open the hook, place it in, take your braiding hair, the smaller piece of the braiding hair, sis, and then you're going to place it on the hook, close the hook and pull it out. So you're going to pull one side out, sis, okay? Making sure it's nice and equal on both sides. And then you're going to flip the hair again, set your natural hair into two, and then give yourself a little tug, but not too tight, you know, just enough that it looks really nice and clean on the bottom. And it is actually gripping the roots for you. That way you don't have to do all the work if you don't know how to grip the roots. If you have never braided hair in your life, this technique right here is for you, sis. Okay, woo! As you guys can hear my voice, I am so hyper happy new year, woo! Today's shout out goes to Lucilia's Kitchen. That's my sister. Happy New Year, my sis. Thank you so much for supporting my channel. Thank you for rocking with me. Thank you for all the love. I really, really appreciate you. You are a real one today. Okay, sis. Once you go to the end right there, you're just gonna take a little piece and go around and then tie a little knot. I'm going to show you guys again. You're going to take um, your rubber band out, take your um, shine and jump, apply it to the hair, and then, you know, take your rubber band and secure it again. You're just gonna take your crochet needle, open the hook, place it in, and then take your braiding hair, the smaller piece of the braiding hair, place it on the hook and pull it out. And then once you pull it out, you're going to make sure it's nice and equal on both sides, and then you're going to give your natural hair a little tug. So once you give your natural hair a little tug, you're going to take a little bit more of the shine and jam, apply it to your remaining of the natural hair, and then you're going to take the bigger piece of the braiding hair, place it on the top, and start going round with it, like you're going into a circle, and then, you're going to start braiding all the way down. Guys, make sure you believe in yourself. Just believe in yourself just as much as I do believe in you guys. I believe in every one of you guys. I believe that anything that you wish, anything that you can manifest in, anything that you want can actually come all the way through. 
Do whatever you want to do in life. And trust me, when you do it, when you put 110% in whatever you want to do, I'm telling you, sis, you are going to make it happen. It's going to come all the way through. And let me tell you, do not doubt in yourself. Do not doubt in anything that you want to do. End of December 2020, we were at 50,000 subscribers, guys. And can you imagine how much, how much growth we had in 2021? When it hit January 1st, I was like, Lord, I believe we're going to get to 100K by this year. I believe believe and declare i believe we are going to be at a hundred thousand and guess what guys we went a hundred thousand and even more we went as far as three hundred and seventy one thousand subscribers can you guys believe can you guys even imagine how much growth we had in 2021 as of january 2nd right now we are at 372 thousand subscribers and i am believing i believe and declare that this year we are going to hit 1 million subscribers and this is me claiming it this is me believing that this is already going to happen so make sure this year guys you actually start believing in yourself believe in your dreams believe in whatever you're doing this technique right here sis is so so easy anybody can actually do this beginner friendly you know what you can actually do this if you have never braided hair by yourself this year 2022 is the year that you are about to do that sis you are about to braid hair by yourself i mean 2022 we are coming in hot okay yeah, yeah. So once you go to the end right there, you're just gonna take a little piece and go around and then tie a little knot. I'm going to show you guys again, you're going to take shine and jump, apply it to the hair and then, you know, take your rubber band and secure it again. So you're just gonna take your crochet needle, open the hook, place it in and then take your braiding hair, the smaller piece of the braiding hair, place it on the hook and pull it out. And then once you pull it out, you're going to make sure it's nice and equal on both sides. And then you're going to give your natural hair a little tug. So once you give your natural hair a little tug, you're going to take a little bit more of the shine and jam, apply it to your remaining of the natural hair. Then you're going to take the bigger piece of the braiding hair and then you're going to start braiding all the way down. So once I'm done braiding, I'm just going to take my coconut oil mixture with my Jamaican black castor oil and make sure my scalp is really nice and juiced up or whatever. And then I'm going to take my scissors, you know, just to make sure I cut all the flyaways. And then I'm taking my mousse, honey, just to make sure everything is nice and laid and settled and everything, honey, everything is nice and laid. Okay. Anyway, so once I'm done, you know, using my um, mousse, I'm just going to take my hot water just to make sure I seal all the ends nice and good. So make sure you're very, very careful because this is hot water. You don't want to burn yourself. And then I'm going to take my towel and dry it up. And then I'm going to take my Kiss Edge Fixer just to make sure my baby hairs are nice and laid, honey. We about to lay this baby hairs because we about to be looking cute out in the streets, okay. I'm just going to take my styling strip and make sure everything is nice and laid and bad, bad. When I tell you, these braids came all the way through. I'm living for these braids right here. Let me know if you guys are feeling them. Let me know if you guys are loving them. Let me know if you guys are going to be trying this style right here. This technique right here is the easiest technique of them all. Since when I tell you, if you are not able to braid by yourself, if you are not able to braid your daughter's hair, your sister, your mama, your cousin's hair, I mean, this technique right here is going to work every single time, honey. When I tell you, I am feeling this braids right about now. And you already know, I cannot be the accessorizing queen without adding some accessories, right? So I'm going to be adding this gold accessories that I got from Amazon and Bebe. It is turning this style all the way to... 1,000 now, okay? 
if you have not shared my videos with your cousins, your besties, your mamas, and your aunts, you better do it right now, sis. Hit the share button just to make sure everybody, every close friend of yours is looking cute out in the streets. Okay, and you know me, I gotta give you a few styles here and there. Um, bad, bad, these styles are coming all the way through as well. Let me know if you guys are loving this color right here. Let me know if you guys are loving this technique. Let me know if you guys are loving the size of this braid. <laughs> Thank you guys for all you have done in 2021. I hope this year is going to be as great and I hope this year is going to be even better than 2021. This year, we are claiming it. This year is going to be great. Anyway, thank you guys so, so much for watching my videos. Thank you guys so, so much for subscribing. Thank you guys so much for sharing. Thank you guys so much for commenting. Oh my gosh, I cannot believe we are here today. Thank you from the bottom of my heart. You guys are the real MVPs. Make sure you share this video with your friends, your cousins, your mamas, and your aunt for sharing is caring. And I will catch you guys in my next one. Bye.